What role do you look back on that you missed out on and go, man, that was the one that got away? Was there one that you, you auditioned for or mm. uh, you maybe passed over and then you saw the, the show or the movie and went, ah, I, sh- I could have done that, I should have done that, or? Well, okay, so, well, okay. So, <laughs> um, there was a movie called Cider House Rules. Okay, yeah. That I, mm-hmm. And I didn't do something, so therefore I missed out on it. I'm not saying the person who got it did. I'm yeah. just saying I didn't. Um, and I remember telling my dad, um, you know, I've never spoken about this really, what Harvey did. You know, it's out there with everybody. I've never told, uh, when this happened, my manager came to me and said, do you have a statement? or?" Do you, you know, do you want to talk about this? And We're talking about Harvey Weinstein. Harvey Weinstein. And he tried three times with me. And um, once, uh, twi- twice was in New York and then once was in London. And um, I belted him. I flat out belted it. Like I, you know. Yeah. Like so, it's kind of weird that I'm talking about this now, but like I, I'm so grateful for all of the women that stood up and, and did, like Rose McGowan, oh, come on. I mean, these women are amazing. But, um, so yeah, I lost out on that role because of that hairy but pig. But that's for Sorry. good reason. No, that's for good reason though. Well, yeah, and I called my dad and I told him what happened. He's like, Maki, what, well, that's my nickname. He, you know, I was like the boy of the family. He's like, what'd you do? I'm like, <laughs> I couldn't say, I mean, I, I really hit him where it hurt. Yeah. Yeah. Well, in his bathroom, like, you know, it was... It was, was it prominent uh, in Hollywood back then? Or it, does it continue now, do you think? It conti- I think it'll continue forever. And I think it also continues with, you know, women that are uh, influential on young men, too. So I think it goes both ways. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 